Welcome back, my wasted youth. This is Rev taking you through Pokemon Special Pikachu Edition. When last we left our intrepid hero, we had caught an Articuno, completely finished everything in Seafoam Island, and we're on our way to a place called Cinnabar Island. Well, I don't know anything about it, but I do know we still have this beauty to take care of. So, let's take care of her now. Okay, lab for Pokemon. Oh, very cool. Okay, we're definitely going to have to check that out right after we beat you up. Now, this beauty has got, well, nothing we haven't seen. She has a level 31 Poliwag. Okay. So, I'm going to switch into Pikachu. And Pikachu is just going to rip right through this thing, I hope. And so, let's see if Thunder is going to miss. Of course it is, but you know what? That's okay. Pikachu is asleep. We are going to use the Poke Flute. Yes, and just like that, well, Pikachu is awake and now getting slapped around. I don't mind that. Double Slap is not going to do that much damage, and that's really all fine. So if Pikachu can actually hit with Thunder, we should be okay. So let's see if we can Thunder again. And just like that, well, Poliwag is down. Perfect. So now the next one she is going to send out is a level 31 Sea King, and that's fine. Let's see if Thunder can... Yeah, looks like it can. Rip right through Sea King. Perfect. So Pikachu is going to gain a level, and that will be it. We've just defeated Beauty. Everything okay? Oh no, not volcanoes. So now we have to go to a volcanic island. Hey, we just came to a volcanic island. Let's see what everybody has to say. That's true. I would agree with that, unless the items really stink. Oh yeah, okay, good call. Huh. Well, now let's see what else we've got. Hey, we've got a Pokemon Center. Perfect. Um, it's kind of a personal thing. No, no, I don't. No friends whatsoever. Oh, okay. Yep, I would agree with that. That's why we're going to go trade as many as we can. Oh, really? Okay, see, I think you're talking like uh, if we had left Squirtle alone instead of evolving to Blastoise, he would have learned Hydro Pump ten levels earlier. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's definitely a way to do it. And now I think that since we have been told that by two trainers, well, two people, that that's definitely going to be an issue. Perfect. Hi. Oh, really? The burned out building. Nice. Okay. Doors locked. That's not going to help us at all. Hi. Oh, really? Oh, no. So... Blaine lives in a volcano. Beautiful. Yeah, that's Quizmaster. Oh, that can't be good. That can't be good. That's okay, though. Fiery Town of Burning Desire. Wow, man. Oh, we'll come back to that building in a minute. But for right now, we actually want to go into this building over here. Well, as soon as we get this Pokemon Lab, this is where we want to be. Now, I have actually changed my Pokemon around and picked up some items. I've picked up the old Amber, and I've also picked up the Helix Fossil. So, oh, do you now bring rare Pokemon for examination? Wonderful, man. See, that's Labs found Dr. Fuji. Oh, neat. Okay. Hi, how are you? I would love... Oh, no, I don't have a gold duck. But, you know, I will, so I'll be back. Hi. Oh, did you know... You know what? I've got one, too. Yeah, you know, you're probably right. Hi there. No. No, I don't. I, I will, but for now, I don't. I will be back. I'll talk to you in a little bit. Hey, what is this room? Oh, that's the meeting room. Okay, how about this room? R and D. Oh, that can't be good. Hi. Yes, I know that. I do know that, as a matter of fact. Oh, did you? What did? What can you do with it? 
Oh, very cool. Now, TM35 is metronome. Um, think of it as, as kind of a, you use it and get a completely random action. Yeah. Could go very well, it could be very, very bad. Huh. Hi there, how are you? Oh, you know what? I don't want a muck, but I do have a Kangaskhan, Kangaskhan, excuse me, so, yes, of course I will. You got it, man. Yeah. The only Kangaskhan I've ever caught, and I am about to trade it. Oh yeah, this can't be a good idea. But that's okay, in exchange we are going to get a muck. Yeah. Which we could have just evolved from that Grimer that we caught. And probably that would have been the better way to go, but I do want to go through every single trade in this game. So my one and only Kangaskhan is gone, and in, ex in exchange, we get, well, muck. Yeah. Yes, that's right, now we have our very own muck. Oh, I will. Yes. Oh, you're very welcome. So, let's take a look at what this muck's name is. Sticky. Of course the muck is named Sticky. Why would it be anything but Sticky? Your old muck is great, but yeah, whatever. Hi! Oh, are you now? Very cool. I do have a fossil. I have got a uh, Helix fossil. Yes, I know, man. Oh, really? Oh, I would love that. That would be great. Okay, so there we go. I do, but you know what? I have got... Oh, okay, fine then. Be that way. I've got another one for him, so I am going to have to, um, well, let's see if this works. Leave the building and come back in. Will it still have enough time, or is he going to force us to go and come back again? So let's see. Where were we? I was just outside, man. Okay. And so there we go. No, I don't. Okay, that's fine. You can send it right to the... There we go. So now... Hi! I know you are, man. We just had this conversation. Don't you remember me? I do. You can have Old Amber. Yes. Aerodactyl. Oh, that's very cool. Oh, wonderful. Okay, I would love that. Perfect. Okay, so I've got to go back outside and come back in. You got it, man. I will do exactly that. And then we will see what we are about to get. And yes, though I realize that we don't actually have the room on us, and it will go directly into the PC, that's fine, because fact of the matter is we're not going to use it in the party anyway. But he is going to give us... I was just outside, man. Are you not listening? Okay, no, I don't want to give. There we go. Okay, so you can send it to the Pokemon box. That's fine. And now, what is Aerodactyl? Aerodactyl is a rock and flying type that doesn't evolve. At level 1, it's got Wing Attack and Agility. At level 33, it learns Supersonic. At 38, it learns Bite. At 45, it learns Takedown. And at 54, it learns Hyper Beam. At early levels, it's really mediocre, but the higher the level, the higher the speed and attack stats go. It's got a disadvantage to electric, ice, rock, and water types. As a rock type, it has an advantage to fire, ice, flying, and bug. And as a flying type, it has an advantage to grass, fighting, and bug. Originally named Terra, they wanted a name that rhymed with pterodactyl. And so they chose pterodactyl and air. So, there you go. Oh, see, that's very cool. And with that, now we've got two brand new Pokemon. Wonderful. So what exactly does this mean? Well, now we have actually got to go into that building. Yeah, I know. It's a tough one. Now, we are going to run into a few different Pokemon here. We are going to run into Grimers and Mucks. We are going to run into Ratatas and Raticates. We're also going to run into Growlithe here. Yeah. So, now, everything is going to be between levels 20 and about level 37, so that's a pretty big jump. Now, if you want to go up these stairs right away and right down to this area here. In this room, you'll find another staircase. If you take it, 
you will be put out right beside this little statue. Hey, there's a secret switch. Of course I'm going to put... Well, yeah, who wouldn't? Okay, now all that's going to end up doing is opening up the rest of this mansion. We are going to take on this mansion two different times. The first time just to get everything out of the way, the second time to actually come through and catch all the Pokémon and do everything else. So first, we've gone up those two staircases, we've only hit that one switch, and now we just drop right down here. And hey, there we are! Now, it might be a good idea to save your game. I'm not going to bother, though. Hi there! Oh, well, yeah, I know. So you're going to attack us anyway, aren't you? Of course he is. This scientist, no real surprise, has got electric types for us. Okay. I am totally fine with electric types, and I'm going to throw out Venusaur, who, up, to, up until this point, has just been fighting Rattatas and Raticates. Self-destruct is bad, but that's okay, it shouldn't wipe us out. Hey, that's great! So, Venusaur actually gains some experience here. Perfect. Sends out Weezing. I'm not worried about Weezing at all. A few Razor Leaf, and that should be that. Our levels are high enough that it looks like, with two Razor Leaf, Weezing should go down. And with that second one, we have now defeated that scientist. Perfect. Anything you want to say? Yeah, ouch. Okay. You okay? Oh, no. We gotta find a key again? Oh, man. What is this? Carbos? Hey, we could always use Carbos. So, now, I still want to check out what's in the rest of this place. There is still a lot of stuff that we've got to look through here. This is not... Hey! We're outside! That is great, but doesn't really help us, does it? No, it doesn't, so we're going to have to go right back in. So, now, in this area, we are actually going to try and find, well, a couple of Pokémon. One of them we can find on this floor. Well, that's the problem. See, now that I actually have Lapras in the front of the party, next time we see one of those Growliths, I'm going to try and use Sing on it, and then use Water Gun. Turns out Water Gun is really effective. What's this? Well, wouldn't you know, in the fifth pillar up from the bottom, on the right, you'll find that Moonstone. Now this is also the area that I plan on doing all my off-screen level grinding to gain as many Pokémon as we need, just to fill out that Pokédex. Now, in the meantime, though, it might just be a good idea to check out the rest of this place. Hey, what is this? Escape rope? Oh, you know I'll sell that. Huh. What could be down here? Well, let's see what is down in this last, or last room down here. Huh. Okay, well, you know that's probably where we're going to have to go, but that's not going to help us. So it seems to me that we don't really have much of a choice. We kind of have to open some doors, don't we? That's terrible. Okay, well, let's start finding some ways of opening doors. Well, you know, I know of one, but unfortunately that's all the time we have for next... See, that's too bad. Well, you know I gotta give it a shot. Okay, so first I'm going to hit Sing. And I put it to sleep. That's beautiful. So, now let's try to water gun. Wonderful. And Growlithe is fast asleep, so let's see if we can actually catch it. One, two... Brilliant! So, now we have caught ourselves a Growlithe. That is great! And just like that, we've caught a Growlithe? No, I don't. But unfortunately, that is all the time we have for this episode. Thank you very much for watching. This has been Rev, taking you through Pokemon Special Pikachu Edition. Till next time!